traffic in the Haitian capital came to a screeching halt on Wednesday as demonstrators blocked roads in Port-au-Prince, protesting the crippling fuel shortages, which have left most gas stations around the country closed. Every time they want to raise fuel prices, they say that there is scarcity. That's not true. They're stuck. There is no need to cause the people pain. They will not be able to do so. If they are determined to raise old prices, we will set the country on fire and they will all disappear. The shortages were intensified by deadly gang violence last week, which erupted in the neighborhood of Cité Soleil, forcing a major fuel terminal to suspend its operations and killing scores of people. Some residents of the embattled Cité Soleil neighborhood have fled and are taking refuge in this park. It's difficult. It's impossible to live here. There's a lot of bullets flying everywhere. We can't go outside, and even inside the house, we're not safe. Thousands of people stayed behind in Cité Soleil, where they're trapped without food and water. <laughs>